What is going on, everybody? Shady Spidey back with another Shady Spidey's Web of News. What's going on, guys? What I have for you today is some Anthem news brought to us by Reddit user iGameYT. Uh, posted up a list of questions that were actually answered this weekend um, from the developers of Anthem. Uh, so let's go ahead and jump right in. So let's go ahead and jump right in. I'm going to speed through these as, as quickly as I can as to not take up too much of your of your time. So first things first, uh, it seems that the early access game uh, gameplay that we will be able to get once we pre-order the game uh, will progress over to the full game, which is an interesting thing being that the, um, the Destiny community actually had requested that when the betas for 1 and 2 actually were out. So that's interesting to see that they're looking at, at that. Next up, uh, it seems that finally at PAC West, we're finally going to get to see the uh, story that is going to be taking place in Anthem, which has been has been something on everybody's mind since we first saw Anthem. So it's good to see we're finally going to see what the story is all about. Uh, next up, uh, loot tiers are as follows. Wh uh, white are common, green are uncommon, blue are rare, purple are epic, and gold are legendary. So a very similar archetype to what Destiny... Uh, has already implemented in their game, which I do not mind because I, I don't mind familiar. I don't mind the fact that the game is going to be familiar to people who have invested so much time in games like Destiny. Moving right along, another thing is color schemes can also be changed without penalty. So if anybody's familiar with uh, Destiny, the shaders in Destiny, once you put them on, if you remove them, you lose them. In Anthem, uh, this will not happen. You will actually be able to customize it however you want. Um, Next up, variety is key when it comes to the freedom of customization. They want everybody to feel that you can 100% customize your freelancer however you want. Um, another another tidbit is the sex of the trend uh, of the freelancer can be chosen at the beginning of the game. So depending on if you want to start your game as a male or a female, um, you'll be able to do that at the beginning of the game. Very similar to Destiny. Uh, it is not yet known if there's going to be other um, other. Uh, races or any type of like exo uh, race similar to destiny um, one thing that's interesting to note was that the storm javelin own, uh, is the only class that has a cape so for all you superhero fans the storm class is going to be the one to go go with if you want to fly around in superhero fashion uh, everyone's uh, everyone can choose also the same javelin so basically if you want to have your squad running uh, for four Titan javelins, then you could also uh, do that as uh, if you wanted to um, Now speaking of javelins, uh, it seems that there was some top-secret Info on the storm javelin that they didn't want to share It seems that they were deflecting when they were asked about the storm uh, about the storm javelin uh, Another thing is freelancer perk for uh, for the pickup radius um, Every, I guess the javelins are going to have a specific perk for their freelancer that allows them to pick, uh, pick up stuff from a farther radius or maybe it's, uh, you know, magnets. I, I'm not sure, but uh, that's definitely an interesting thing. Um, certain weapons are also able to be shared across your javelins and some are specific to that javelin. So similar to uh, Destiny as well, where you have specific armor gear that is only used by a warlock or a titan or a hunter, uh, the same will follow suit in a Anthem as well. Um, one uh, one other thing to note is uh, no skins or uh, attachments are scheduled at launch. So if you're if there's a specific skin or attachment that is promised as DLC, do not expect to get it at launch. Expect to get it at the DLC. And lastly, cosmetics do not affect your power level or ge uh, your gear level has a separate level uh, on its own. So another thing that's similar to Destiny, where you will have your power level and your light level. Um, it it has not been determined yet exactly what those levels are going to be called, but uh, one can only assume. So uh, that pretty much does it for all the new Anthem news. Um, I apologize for the amateur looking video. Um, I am doing this right now from my office because I read this and I needed to do it as soon as possible. I just wanted to get the info out. So I hope everybody gained something from the video. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button If you hit the if, and also hit the subscribe button. 
if you want to follow more of my content. I will be doing these more regular, more regularly here in the future. Uh, but uh, till then, be good. Game great. Shady's out.